We've been waiting to see just what John Boehner, he said he would sue the president in court. Now we know what he will sue about. And some conservatives are scratching their heads about this. The Re House Republicans are going to sue the president because they believe, and some constitutional scholars actually agree with them, that after Obamacare was passed, the president used administrative powers to change things and to delay the employer mandate, for example, and to change some other things. And the House Republicans are going to sue Jackie, saying he overstepped his bounds. Now, again, there are some conservative and some other constitutional scholars who say they might have a case, but conservatives scratch their heads saying, wait a minute. So we're going to sue him because he delayed the employer mandate, and if we win, what happens? They have to more quickly implement Obamacare? I thought conservatives wanted to repeal Obamacare. <laughs> right. Well, and I, the, the fact of the matter is, this won't even, let's say this, this lawsuit is actually successful, this won't even affect Obama. This would be going through so, right. so many levels of the court. It wouldn't even affect him. And yeah, I mean, it, it, it's highly unlikely this goes anywhere. And there's also, I mean, the, the immigration piece that they have been complaining about right. wasn't in there either. Right. You know, you were talking about fifth grade, how life is fifth grade. You know, these, these two leaders sometimes sound really codependent, and that, that clip really proved it. They're both getting, they're both ramping up their rhetoric. Each is very happy to play off the other. And for John Boehner, this lawsuit's a really necessary steam valve, you know, at a time when a lot of Republicans are, are pounding the impeachment right. drum, uh, are saying, you know, that, that Obama in general is something of a tyrant. Um, this is a very important lawsuit for John Boehner.